Stop staring at the food and don't even think about food until your stomach growls. So it's a lot of fun. No, I get it. To be I set free. Amazing. Here's the deal Gwen has a weight loss seminar that's tomorrow. She's a pioneer in faith based weight loss, appearing on Tyra, CNN, Larry King Live, in magazines from people to good housekeeping. She has been everywhere. Gwen Shamlin is the founder of Way Down Ministries. She says, to turn away from the refrigerator, we have to turn to God. Her methods have helped people shed as much as 300 pounds. When should we say welcome back home? That's Glad right. to have you back here in Memphis. I mean, it's so it's such a joy always to go back to your hometown. I believe that the shaking that God's doing. Is, a, is it should be enough. It should be enough. The problems you've had with your own health should be enough. All the problems with your own family and your children should be enough to know that God's shaking it up. And in every generation, he has done that. And had everyone face the final frontier and the final stronghold. And that's their church. People do not want to give it up. I'm asking you to go back now and open up your eyes and look and see if people have not brought idols into the church and that it's mainly polytheistic, where there's one corner where people are bowing down to the dollar bill and one corner where people are bowing down to food, one corner where people are bowing down to self, one where people are bowing down to sexual lust, the praise of men, and that there's a Jesus being taught that doesn't exist. All this stuff breaks my heart. With the churches uh, decreasing in number, with the recession that we're in, uh, with the p potential of everything ailing out, where it doesn't seem like that there's a recovery anytime soon, uh, with the, um, the natural disasters that are happening, with the world going chaotic and the children out of control, there is a respite and there is a new Jerusalem. Where God will reign or lie, where all the children dance on the streets and sing for us. I'm just learning more and more and more how to get under authority, and that's where it all starts is getting under authority. And you will see that by that, the veil is lifted, and you see what I'm doing is wrong. I've got to lay it down, fill up with God, and your life will change. Everything about uh, who I am has changed based off this message. I got to lose uh, 50 pounds of just, I mean, I was obese at 12 years old and just was horribly overweight and just had a lot of anger and emotional issues. Everything about this is so, just so sweet. That just that there's that deep relationship that you get to have with, with God and just would not trade this message for the world. I have been able to lay down greed for food and greed for praise of man and just anger. I have a better relationship with my brother and sister and with my parents and I'm praising God that he has allowed me to be part of this amazing truth. I never had a relationship with God and now I can say I do. Um, I, I can honestly say I know what it means to be boastful in the Lord now because um, with answered prayers, you I mean it's everything. Even though I'm type 1 diabetic, um, God's allowed me to lose uh, 62 pounds. My life has changed and all of our lives are changed 
because of this message and because God has shown us His truth. The holy lands, where God will reign on high, where all the children dance on the streets and sing for Adonai. So send out the call and blast the trumpets and lift your hands up high. We're on a journey.